Hey, thanks for watching another Photoshop tutorial. Today we're going to cover symmetry. Diagonal symmetry to be exact. Let's just open a sample here so I can show you what I'm talking about. Here we go, a perfect example of diagonal symmetry. Now, let me show you how to do this. Let's create a new document the same size. And let's create our first layer. Let's just use half of this playing card. Find the center point. And using the marquee tool, you can copy and paste into our new document. So there's the first half. Let's convert this to a smart object. And this allows us to duplicate it now. And we're going to choose the transform tool, edit, free transform, edit, transform, flip horizontal, edit, transform, flip vertical, and drag it down to the bottom of your document until it lines up might have to make a few adjustments. So basically that's diagonal symmetry. Um, we can see here that they've made some changes to either side of the card. This card was not drawn um, exactly this way. They've gone back and and done it um, more of a, a vertical or a horizontal symmetry at points, um, which is fine. You can do that as well. Okay, so let's say we wanted to make some changes. Changes are good. Let's double click on our first layer and make some changes to it. We can even use adjustment layers. Let's add a new solid color. Let's add a turquoise. Let's hide it for now. Let's select this red in the crown and remove it from our mask. Save. I'm just using Command S on Mac or Control S on PC and go back to our original. And there it is. So let's put these side by side. And now we can work on this and see it update live. There are other plugins that will help you do this. I haven't found anything that lets you do it real time in Photoshop. There are other programs that will let you do symmetry in real time. Um, Photoshop doesn't seem to have a lot of plugins that let you do that. There are other plugins that will do the symmetry effect for you or actions that will do this uh, layer effect for you. And uh, you're more than welcome to, to Google that and check those out. But uh, the gist of it is that you use smart objects and you duplicate them and flip them and that gives you your diagonal symmetry. And thanks to Michelle for sponsoring and inspiring this tutorial. You can see her website at inamoratagames.com.